What is up? My name is Jay. In this video, I want to show you how you can create your own shortcode for your WordPress theme. I'm here at wordpress.org in the shortcode API. You can scroll down a little bit and you will see one of the shortcodes right here. This is an example. If you work with WordPress, you are very familiar with this. For example, this one is a gallery and you can change the ID and you can actually choose the size of the photos. A lot of themes out there are using chart codes to generate stuff like galleries, contact forms, even whole pages. So I'm gonna scroll a little bit and here is an example of a basic short code we're gonna work with something like this today and you can add more attributes and when i say when i mean by attributes is these things right here like this and this so you can keep adding more and more but for now in this video we're gonna just create a basic short code okay so i'm gonna go to my site here and you can see that i have my home page and it's empty there's nothing here i have a sidebar with some Lauren Ibsen text right here. So every time I create a website and I don't have the content, I just go to the Lauren Ibsen site and I just copy and paste it. But I don't wanna do that again. I just wanna create my own short code that I just add to my page and it generates my Lauren Ibsen for me. I don't have to go back, copy and paste, copy and paste, okay? I'm gonna jump to my text editor and here I have all my theme files. You can see it's a child theme. That's why there is, I don't have a ton of files and folders. But I want you to go to your functions.php, okay? You will have a lot of more code than me, maybe. So I want you to go there and we're gonna get our hands a little bit dirty. So if you don't know PHP, don't worry, don't be scared. I'm gonna upload this code and the link is gonna be in the description of this video. You can download it and play with it, learn a little bit more, but don't be scared, okay? Let's break the ice today, let's go. So I'm gonna create a function. It can be called whatever you want. I'm gonna call it Laura function, for example. All right, this is our function. Some brackets. And inside here, I'm gonna return something and this is something's gonna be the Lauren Epson text okay so I'm gonna create some quotation marks semicolon in between these quotation marks the Lauren Epson is gonna be here or whatever HTML or anything that you want is gonna be inside here so I'm gonna create some paragraph tags this is HTML and between those I'm gonna just copy this whole Lauren Ibsen text from here, copy and paste it. All right, so I have all my Lauren Ibsen right here and that's perfect. All right, we have our function, function is ready. This block of code is our function. And now we need to kind of talk to WordPress. So I need to say to WordPress that this is my shortcode, this function. So I'm gonna add this, add shortcode. Oops. This is coming from the uh, WordPress API, okay? All right. And inside here, this is the name of my shortcode right now. So I'm gonna name it Lorem something very simple. So it's gonna be something like this. All right, something like this. So this is very important. I'm gonna remove that. And now a comma. And in here, I'm gonna add the function. So we are telling that this is my shortcode name and this, what my shortcode is going to do. So everything inside this function is gonna be my shortcode. Don't worry if you're lost right now. I know that maybe you're like, oh, all right, but I, I don't know. I don't understand why, what, what is this and what is that? Don't worry. I know that after this, you will understand a little bit and then you can go there and learn a little bit more about PHP and this function and stuff. All right, so I'm gonna click save. For now, 
this is perfect. This, this is the short code is created. It's going to generate this when we add the lorem short code. So let's go. I'm here at my home page. Let's click edit page. Lorem. Okay, that's my short code. Let's see. Look at that beauty. Now I can repeat this in whatever page I want. I can actually, uh, I don't know. I'm going crazy here. All right. The thing is that I want to, I want more content right now because this is, this is kind of empty. So what I can do, I can just copy the short code and paste it all over again. And let's see. All right. It, it works. Okay. But I don't like to repeat. So I'm going to go back to my uh, functions.php, back to my code here. And I'm going to do something different. So I'm going to create a variable of, let's say, text. And my variable is equal to all of this. All right. So I'm going to just cut and paste it here. All right. I want to duplicate this by three. So I'm going to use a PHP function for this. This is a function. String repeat. All right. And here I'm going to add the variable. This one right here, which contains all this comma and the times I want to repeat this whole content right here, which is three times. You can change it to whatever number you want. All right. I'm going to save it. The shortcode stays the same. And let's reload this page. And there you go. We have three paragraphs right there. I can go back to the code and let's say I'm going to change it to six. Save it. Let's reload the page. And look at that. We have six. That's beautiful. Now, we can do something even better, but is that's going to get more complex for this video. I just wanted to show you the basics, but we can do something like, for example, uh, duplicate equals to six. I promise you that I'm going to create a video for this, but for now we're going to stay with the basics. And I hope you understand a little bit about this. If you don't leave a comment, and I will help you a little bit to understand if you don't, but go out there. I'm going to post the links and, and the code so you can read and learn a little bit more, but I hope it helps. All right. And that's it. Subscribe if you want to keep learning and click on the bell icon to receive notifications every time I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a beautiful day. Bye bye.